Hi. Fluxus African Contemporary Art is really uh, a complex, complex because there are many things inside, a beautiful manifestation which uh, starts from a principle, a very actual one, which is that uh, Africa is uh, an in-becoming culture about which many, many people, cultured and sensible, are interested all over the world, and which uh, uh, has to be treated according to us. That's one of the principles of uh, uh, these uh, uh, events all together, uh, which uh, has to be treated not choosing one artist which uh, is kind of, uh, I don't know, a star and this kind of success and consumerist uh, ideals, but which is and wants to be part of a very bigger, more important trend involving Africa with all its 45 nations and maybe some other will come in uh, in some time and where everyone respects everyone else and likes to cooperate with everyone else. The concept of fluxus. Fluxus is a name which really for very different reason uh, as always involved great movements which were starting and when this thing starts everybody's friend of everybody else and they come from all over the world uh, as it happened in the original fluxus movement of the 60s and 70s which involved so many great people and artists from all over the world and where I was included as one of the Italian representatives. <laughs> By chance, uh, Fluxus is also uh, a video which uh, we uh, included in this great anthology with artists which come from very many different parts of Africa, which are Morocco, Algeria, Ethiopia, Kenya, Angola, and South Africa. And the young guy who created this video fluxus didn't know anything about the other fluxus. But uh, this situation which we are presenting uh, through uh, this great collection uh, permits to us to understand that the spirit in which uh, these videos have been created and in which these artists love to collaborate is very similar to the other one and to all the situations when you are really involved and really uh, desire to create a new world and that was happening now so video fluxus african contemporary arts is showing us what is happening really now in order to create a new africa world everybody expecting what are we going to find through this uh, great anthology including uh, uh, many artists coming from different parts of the 54 countries which now exist in Africa and which have been sensibly and very intelligently collected by the Sindica Docolo Foundation, which is an African foundation. So, this is really materials, work, actual creative works, which comes from Africa. And they have been detected in Africa, and this is very important because it is no more 
European or Western people who decide what is important. But they themselves are now able and desire really to build up a new culture which is obviously a culture in transformations, fluxus as we said, but which also represents the many important uh, desires the different countries and Africa as a, as a continent or as, as a traveled continent which is now on great rise and we are happy about this but also uh, because of all the difference it has it has also problems of identity so uh, really uh, what all these artists demonstrate is that they are really looking trying to find uh, through movement dynamics, uh, meetings, uh, a new identity, is a new identity from which to develop uh, the Africa of the present and the future in uh, mainly three fields. One is the field of the land land which is city, which is urban, obviously, but which can also be country and uh, which can be all the many different ways uh, from which uh, this country is, can be defined. Obviously, the great savage nation, which is a great energy and also, obviously, is a tr nature in transformation, which is becoming civilization. Second field are obviously the people. So many different people, many ethnicities, many genders, and many other problems of every kind, but also opportunities. Problems are becoming opportunities. And so, and there's the second field, identity, memory, presence, figure, and so on. And the third is soul, which obviously has to do with many different aspects, which are religion or other kind of institutional attitude, and also very private kind of ones. All these artists, through their works, are offering us their own view about this. And this is great. And uh, in the Spazio Gera we find all of this plus uh, some, uh, an anthology devoted to William Kendrick, which is uh, representing himself, obviously, but also a country which has uh, had a very, very difficult life in the past because of the apartheid and which is South Africa. Thank you.